Welcome back to Arsenal News TV and today we're going to first look at Arsenal star Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang tells Miklos that's uh, his favourite position and then we're going to look at Arsenal targeting Paolo Fonseca to leave Roma as new Tottenham manager option surfaces. So the first news headline states that Arsenal star Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang tells Miklos Setter his favourite position. So the reports are stating that Arsenal star Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang has sent a message to his manager. Arsenal captain Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang has made it clear to Mikel Arteta the position he prefers to play ahead of Thursday's Europa League semi-final against Villarreal. Arsenal trailed 2-1 heading into the second leg at the Emirates following last week's defeat in Spain. Villarreal, Unai Emery will return to North London for the first time as a manager since being sacked by the Gunners in November 2019. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang did not start last week's match as he had not returned to full match fitness following his bouts of malaria. The Gabon star has often played on the left-hand side of the attack under Miklod Setsa with Alexandre Lacazette the main central striker. But Aubameyang says he prefers to playing down the middle in a clear message to his manager. As a centre forward, I try to be more involved in the game because the coach is expecting from our number 9 to give some solutions to play during the game, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang told reporters. So it's a bit different when you come from the left, but I try to give my best because I know that I'm there to improve sometimes when I'm playing with my back to the goal, it's a different role. Maybe in the beginning it was easy to play on the left because I have so much more space. It's a difficult role and I'm just happy to play centre forward because I've used to play there for a few seasons. This is my favourite role and that's it. Thursday's match is the biggest of the season for Arsenal as they attempt to reach the final which qualifies and gives them a chance of winning silverware and qualifies for the Champions League. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang's message to his teammates is not to leave anything on the pitch. In this type of game, it is to give everything to have no regrets, he added. After the game, we have to give everything to win this game. And of course, don't forget to enjoy on the pitch because this is how we perform well on the pitch when we are enjoying. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang has scored just 15 goals in a below-pass campaign so far. And he admits he feels partly responsible for the poor results Arsenal have had this season. He said, The season has been difficult. Everyone was expecting me to score more goals. I know it. Maybe I feel a bit responsible for the situation we are in right now, but we have a chance to change it. So it looks like Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang has told Miklotessa his favourite position and he has sent a message to his manager in the latest press conference where he revealed certain reasons why his campaign this season was very poor. It was due to a number of personal reasons to a number of various number of reasons why Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang didn't hit the heights that everyone expected after they signed that mega contract which was worth more than £350,000 per week. And in terms of Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, he has made it clear to Mikel Arteta that his favourite position is playing as the main central striker. And he likes to play in that number 9 role because he has the opportunity to play where he has usually played under um, many managers at Borussia Dortmund and he's someone that wants to play in that number 9 position and score goals as that's what we need in the game versus Villarreal. So you have to see how Aubameyang performs in the game versus Villarreal and this nice insight takes us on to the second piece of news which states that Arsenal target Paolo Fonseca to leave Roma as new Tottenham manager option services. So the reports are stating that Paolo Fonseca is reportedly on Arsenal's radar if the club decides to part company with Mick Arteta. Roma have confirmed that manager Paolo Fonseca will leave the club at the end of the season, just two days out from the Europa League semi-final second leg with Manchester United. The Portuguese's future became uncertain following his side's 6-2 drubbing at Old Trafford last Thursday in a game that Roma had led 2-1 at half-time. Fonseca's stock was high just a few months ago when his side was on course to secure the return of Champions League football. However, Cracks have started to emerge in the past six weeks, particularly on the road where Roma's away form has become a major issue. Sunday's 2-0 defeat at Sampdoria proved to be the final straw for Fonseca as the club confirmed this afternoon that they'd agreed to part company with the former Shakhtar boss. He will remain in charge for the rest of the season before the termination of his contract. Several reports are credited also with interest in his services in recent weeks. It's alleged that Arsenal board have lined up Fonseca as a potential replacement for Mikel Arteta should they decide to sack the Spaniard. 
The Gunners are said to have already contacted Fonseca's representatives prior to his departure from Roma. Yet they are not the only club in North London who may be interested in his availability. Tottenham's options to replace Jose Mourinho remain incredibly limited as things stand. Julian Nagelsmann will join Bayern Munich while Brendan Rodgers ruled himself out of the running due to his commitment to Leicester City. Ajax spokes Eric Ten Hag then became the front runner before signing a surprise new deal in Amsterdam. Graham Potter and Reverso Martinez are now among the leading candidates for the role, but Fonseca's name may now creep into contention. Crystal Palace and Leeds have also credited with an interest in the former Proto and Braga manager. The 48-year-old, who was born in Mozambique, has now thanked everyone at Roma for the times they've shared together since he arrived in 2019. Over these last two years, we have experienced a number of highs and lows, but I always have given all my for my club and this city. A city that has always been so welcoming, Fonseca said. I would like to say thanks to the Roma fans, everyone we have worked with, Triguero, the players and all those who helped us during the journey in particular Dan and Ryan Friedkin, for their continuous support since they arrived, and Thiago Pinto, an incredible professional whom I wish the best as he continues his work for the club. We still have some very important games in front of us this season that we want to win, and we will continue to give our all in order to do so. And it looks like Arsenal target Paolo Fonseca is ready to leave Roma as it has been rumoured that Jose Mourinho, or well, it has been confirmed that Jose Mourinho will be the new Ro Roma manager. So this leaves the Arsenal looking for an opportunity if they sack Mikel Arteta, and Fonseca looks like an opportunity for the Gunners to sign as a replacement. In my opinion, I really don't know much about Paolo Fonseca. I don't think he's a brilliant manager. If you're losing to, oh, to Manchester United's by six goals, that's something that you shouldn't have on your CV. I don't know much about this guy. Would he be a suitable replacement? In my opinion, not in my opinion. But other than that, guys, remain blessed. Stay tuned for the next video and peace.